Alrighty, hey guys, you're here, and uh, yeah, Clash Clans. First and foremost, thank you to each and every single one of you click on this video, and an even bigger thank you for all the love and support. But yeah, so the goal of the video is really simple. I'll be using a hybrid, and uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the video. Okay, 21 minutes left, so let's go for number one, and let's see. This is really nice because the bomb towers are by the town hall. Okay, for this one, to start things off, I'll go and place the queen right here, and I do want her to go to the left, and to make sure she does, I'll place a baby drag right here, that way it creates a good funnel over here. This way I can wall break here, and the queen goes inside. To make sure that does happen, I'll place the king here, and I'll wall break here, and I can also place another baby drag right here to create a good funnel, and the king should go inside, and once he targets the air defense, I'll use the earthquake boots and act open up all these walls. This way the king can take all this out, this way the queen can also take all this out as well. Well, that's going on i'll place the siege breaks right here this way it creates a good funnel for the for the hybrid and i can just sit in the hybrid right here that way they go straight to the inside and take out all of this i do want to bring two heals so i'll heal right here and heal right here and that should be the three hopefully there we go real quick plan but hybrid is really simple okay here we go i forgot about the second baby dragon okay because of that wizard right here to start things off queen right here test saloon wait a little bit healers now there we go okay i do need an early rage that could speed everything up Go to wall break over here. That way the queen can go inside. Let's use the king right here to funnel everything in. Wall break him in. Baby drag over here just in case. I am gonna use another rage and two two druids on the king. There we go. So far looking good. Okay, there we go. Let's go and freeze the single inferno. Use the king ability now. Perfect. Siege barracks could have been done sooner, but that's okay. Let's busy the queen. Rage her up. Let's see, let's poison up everything. Looks good to me. Kind of a bad poison, but that's okay. Okay, there we go. Let's go and place the let's place this hybrid now. Perfect. I forgot that I had a baby warden. Let's send the baby warden with the Pekkas. Queen almost died. Let's go and freeze. Dang, I could have saved that freeze, but that's okay. My fault. Early heal. Headhunter for the enemy king. And I do want to hold on to the warden ability as long as possible. One ability now. Okay, there we go. The only bad part about this, I'm not sure how this is gonna go. Okay, and let's see where, where's the best heal. Best heal is right here. Looking good. Let's use the RC ability to get through everything. Perfect. Now she stays out of range of everything. I have four loons, so let's go and use one, two, three, four. Those loons were useless. <laughs> That's okay. Two copies, Archer. Okay, nice. GG to this guy. Great way to start. Okay, I have three attacks. So let's go and go for number seven. Oh, this one's a good one. Okay, to start things off, I do want to use two loons right here and a baby drag. That way I can take all this out. And I can use this open spot right here to use two loons and send in a blimp right here. And with a rage, the Yeti should be able to take all this out. This way I can place the queen right here and she goes up top. And while the queen is moving up top, I'll send in the king right here so that way he goes to the left. And I can use the Earthquake Boots to damage everything. This way the Queen can definitely take all this out. And I can send in the Hybrid right here. That way they go around the whole base. And that should be the three. As long as you keep it simple, you'll be fine. Now I do want to use the Healing Tome with this attack. Because I don't want to worry about it. And I need three Rages for the Queen. I think that'll be fine. So, Test Loon. Two Loons. Baby Drag. Test Loon over here. Make sure I got the Blimp. There we go. And pop the blimp early. Queen right here. And as long as I get the scatter shot and the eagle, I'll be Kuchikopi. Come on, Yetis! Dang, that, that ice column will be. That's okay. I'll make this work. Let's go and race the queen. Let's see. Let's use the bacon. Two bacon should be enough, hopefully. Okay, yeah, perfect. Let's walk back for the queen. I kind of wish I had another test wall breaker, but I think I'll be fine. Okay, change of plans just a little bit. Let's use the king right here, wall break him in. I do want to use two druids again, mainly because when I use his ability because of the giant gauntlet, he'll be fine. There we go. This way, the druids will go to the, the queen, which means I can get even more healing. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Let's go and send the hybrid now. Not too early, I hope. Baby Warden. Okay, perfect. Pigs now. Let's go and use the early heal. Get through everything. Kind of risky. It's a wall break for the queen. That was a bad wall break. <laughs> That's okay. And let's go ahead and use the Warden ability once she gets locks onto the bomb tower. 
One ability now. Get through everything. Queen ability. Okay, there we go. Copy. Let's go ahead and freeze the Ricochet Cannon. Headhunter for the enemy king. Archer right here. And... Oh. Just realized. <laughs> Gotta be running low on time here. That's fine. Rick, freeze the ricochet again. I gotta save the RC ability. That way I can get the corner builder huts. Let's use the RC ability. Now should be fine. That should be enough. Now it's just a matter of time. Do I have enough time? I wasted too much time on everything. Yeah, I'm good though. GG to this guy. And on to the next one. Okay, there we go. I have six minutes to get into attacks. That'll be good. Six minutes. I don't have time to make a detailed plan, so I just gotta wing it. I'll place the queen here in this corner right here. Take a, take this out with a couple loons. This way the queen goes down, and I can use the king to funnel the queen, and I can use the siege barracks in the corner. Real quick plan. Hopefully it goes good. Let's see. Make sure I got everything. Looks good to me. So I do want to start off the queen over here. So I have an idea of where the traps are. Let's go and wait for the queen. There we go. Let's rage her up. Tesla for the hidden Tesla. Perfect. Now the queen should keep moving inside. Let's go and use a wall break to activate the skellies. That way I don't have to worry about it later. Perfect. Now I do know there's two air mines there and that air defense is going to be annoying. But I think it'll be fine. Let's use the king. Let's freeze the single inferno. Send in three loons right there. Let's rage up the queen. That way I don't have to worry about all that. Okay, I don't have to worry about the single inferno. But I do have to worry about the air defense, so let's go and use the hybrid like this. Definitely not ideal, but not the end of the world. Let's go and freeze as well. Use an early warden ability. Perfect. Rage up the queen. She should be able to continue, continue going inside. Let's go and use the siege rex over here. Druid, baby warden. Gone right heal. King ability now. Perfect. Definitely not the prettiest, but I think I'll be fine. Let's see. Let's go and rage the RC. That should be good. This is the only bad part about rushing all your attacks. It's going to busy everything. Baby drag right there. Wizards over here. Two archers right there. Head on for the enemy king. Wall breaks for whatever. Definitely, definitely not a good attack, but a three is a three and I will take it. It's also my fault for rushing. <laughs> okay, there we go. One minute left, just in time. And number 18, looks good to me. Off I go. I gotta treat it like legends. <laughs> okay, this one's the perfect base. Okay, there we go. And gotta make sure I have, I have a life gem, so I gotta remember that. Let's go and use this, this bacon to lure everything. There we go, I do. There should be a Tesla farm. Yep, there is. So, Rage, two loons, Queen right here. Healers now. Archer to speed it up. There we go. Okay, there we go. As long as I get the multi archer, I'll be good to go. There we go. Good timing. One break here. Okay, let's go and poison up all of this. And I do need to Rage. And let's go and use the King right here. Wall break him in. Okay, and let's use the King ability. Now should be good. That's OP. I think I have the most success with this base when I use a log launcher to get to the town hall. This is a pretty old base to be honest, but this is for the perfect war, so gotta be perfect. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now let's go and use a log launcher. Now should be fine. Okay, there we go. Let's use a baby warden to support the queen. And now I can use the the hybrid over here to funnel the queen inside. Go and keep an eye on the queen's health. Druid Druid. RC. Bacon. There we go. Log launcher open up the middle. Perfect. I do want to heal through the damage. Let's rage up the queen along with the freeze. Okay, so far looking great. I don't need to use a warn ability yet. So let's go and use a baby drag right here. Let's use the queen ability. Get through everything really quick. And I'll save the warn ability for the single inferno. Archer right here to speed everything up. You know what? I, I'm not even going to use the Warden ability. GG to this guy and GG to the clan. Wall break here. Wizard, wizard. Got bees. And OP. Definitely makes up for the last attack. Sheesh. <laughs> and there goes the perfect war. Okay, so we're going to swing back to the other clan. 
<laughs> Last war we got it perfect, and this war we got perfected. That's funny. All in good fun. To start things off, I'll place the queen here, that way she can take out the town hall. And whether she goes left or right, it doesn't really matter. But let's just assume the queen goes to the left. I'll use the king right here. This way he goes back. And with a wall break right here, the king should go inside. And with the king ability, he should be able to take all this out. This way, I can wall break the queen right here. And she should be able to take out the monolith. Because I saved the siege barracks, I can use the siege barracks right here. Siege barracks. This way it creates a good phone over the hybrid. And I can just send them all right here to go straight to the eagle. Yeah, really simple plan. Hopefully it goes good. Oh wait, I don't have the king ability. <laughs> Not the king ability I want anyway. That's fine. I'll make it work. Okay, I do want to go ahead and rage the queen. That way she can go through everything a little bit faster. Especially with the monolith. Okay, healers now. Let's go and use the bacon to lure out the CC. And another bacon right here to look at the other skeletons. Perfect. Actually, you know what? Because of the way everything's going, I can rage the queen, wall break here, baby drag right here, king, wall break here, two, two druids, two loons right here, let's go and freeze, I don't need to freeze the monolith, now I do, there we go, let's go and rage the queen, use the king ability now, get through everything quick, okay there we go, siege breaks over here, There we go. Once the queen takes out the ricochet cannon, I can wall break. There we go. Wall break now. And now I can send in the hybrid right here. That'll be good. Headhunter for the enemy queen. Three bacons. Baby warden. Let's go and rage the queen. Get through everything faster. Let's see. Archie's gonna stay out of the way, which is nice. Let's use the queen ability to get through everything. Let's go and freeze the, the eagle. Warden ability for the king. RC ability. Perfect. Nice. Looking good. Invisi the queen. Wizard. Wizard. Okay. GG. This was a good attack. So, archer. Anything else? Nope. Nothing else. So, gobbies. Nice. Well, seeing as how we lost, might as well go for number one. And this one's a good one. To start things off, I use the queen and with a giant arrow, I should be able to use the ability to activate both the invisi towers. This way I can send in a blimp right here and with a rage, she'll be able to take all this out. And on the other side, I'll send in the RC and she should be able to take all this out. And while that's going on, I'll send in the king up here. That way he can create a good funnel for the queen. This way she can continuously go in and go straight to the eagle. And I can send in the hybrid over here to take out whatever's left of this area right here. And they should be able to go around the whole base. Really simple plan. Hopefully it goes good. Okay, to make sure the queen goes up, I do need a baby drag right here. Let's use a test loon. Queen ability. Okay, there we go. Nice. Now I can send in the blimp. Healers here. Rage. I can definitely freeze everything. That'll be good. Uh-oh, queen's gonna... <laughs> queen's being weird. Oh, well, I'll make it work. RC over here. And with a rage, she should be able to take out everything. Okay, queen's being dumb. But I'll, I'll just readjust. There we go. Let's go ahead and busy the RC. I guess I could have sent in the druids with the RC, but that's okay. Let's see, what do I have on the queen? Or I have the life gem on the warden, so I'll use the baby warden with the king. And this is definitely not how I wanted this to go, but that's fine. Four loons, speed everything up. Wizard over here. And let's see. How do I want this to go? Let's rage the queen to speed everything up. There we go. So far, not the best, but not the worst. And let's go ahead and send in the hybrid once the queen gets a little bit more. That should be good. Hybrid now. I'll save onto. I'll save the pigs. Bacon now. Head on for the enemy queen. Let's go and freeze the town hall. Okay, let's go and rage warden ability. There we go. Let's use a wall break. Wall break over here as well. Heal. And king ability once the tornado wears up. King ability now. There we go. GG to the clan for perfecting us. <laughs> Archers, gobbies. There we go. Nice. Great way to end the video. On to the next war. Life gym OP. <laughs> 55. Real quick. We definitely need, need more people for war. Just a quick PSA. 
Hey, okay, this completes the minute. If you made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching. And again, I can't thank you guys enough for all the love and support. But yeah, it's been Aozy guys, and I'll catch you in the next one. Lights, guys.